Hello, my name is Ashley. Today I'm going to show you some of my paintings that I hang them up in my beauty salon, which I want to give you little tips that uh, so you'll have a little bit idea. Uh, for example, I have over here uh, the ocean and the clouds that you see. For example, the clouds that over here that you see how smooth is uh, painted, which is I use the blending brush. When you watch my other video, you will see what brush that you have to use which is the blending brush, it makes it softer, the clouds, and then you see the depth over here, which I first, I put the dark color, the black gesso or the black acrylic, you can paint all beginning, and then you can put uh, linseed oil on it. When you start to paint with oil paint, you will be able to make it smoother, nicer, and cleaner. And uh, on a black color, always, you can use, uh, let's say, blue color, green, green color. It's always, those are transparent color they are. When you see the ocean over here, which I always on the black, you can put uh, green color, which you see the ocean. And when you use a little white, it brings the color out. The, the way you see the ocean over here, this is, I use the fan brush that I told you. The fan brush and the pouncing brush too. A little, some places to make the uh to make the waves over here. So that's what it is. And uh, over here, the mountains, of course, it's a regular brush. And some of the color that I added as a, a moss or what um, green that it gets, algae, that's from pouncing brushes that I used, which is a round brush. And then I put with a fine liner that I put the little birds over here that it's flying. So this is one of my painting. It's maybe it's a little hard to see the birds, which is here you see closer if you come. And that's one of my painting that I've done. Uh, that was an oil paint. And this one over here that you see, it's an acrylic. It's completely black background. I put a flower arrangement and I let it fall down so it kind of blend and it brings more color out. This is all acrylic what I did. And uh, I think it's beautiful. Over here, some of the places I used fan brush on green leaves to make some little lines to put extra color. And uh, that's one of my favorite too. And uh, I would love to show. Uh, over here that you see the ballerina, when you watch my other uh, video, the background one, this is the way you see it. It's all mixed up color, which is blue, black, and uh, purple, and you know white. It's mixed, and I did a little ballerina here with with nice background over here, and then put the ballerina again. You see the ballerina skirt, for example. I pounced it with white, and uh, she's beautiful, and it's very beautiful. It's a simple painting, and it's very very nice. And this painting is a uh, all white uh, wild flowers. It is nothing fancy painting. This is one of my beginning of painting, which is this is almost like my first oil painting. It was, and uh, it's just colorful, joyful. I could have done more work, but this is one of my first ones, so uh, it's one of my favorite. Again, you see like the background, for example, it's only purple with a little white and I just gave the design. So anyway, and uh, this is the roses. Again, like you see the background, there is around this green, yellow, brown, and it's all mixed. But with the blender, I blend, uh, soften it very nicely that it doesn't look harsh from one color to another. It's like all blended and I, painted couple of roses with beautiful margaret and little uh, buds and added green you always have to put nice green leaves to make the flower more richer and nicer that's the one and this one over here you see it's an acrylic and this is three dimension of bird it's a three dimension painting it is more or less it's these are the real feather from macaws that i put it and uh, i used to have macaws birds and it's their feathers they are sitting in amazon i guess in a swamp place in a cool place they are enjoying the 
the waterfall and that's again if you look at the background the top is instant to be blue I just made it like green because it's like a, a in a forest it's like further it shows and the waterfall and the background is it's kind of nice and beautiful and this one that you see it's those are kind of a Middle Eastern things we call this Havan which is a, a garlic smasher the wine and the cheese and the knife it's kind of a little bit like abstract color too because of if you pay attention for the picture the knife the cheese and uh, you see the background it's all I pounce, uh, pounced it put the color with the napkin and you will see you see how is different color it is in the background with the grape and everything so here's another flower painting which is again the background you'll see it's like more purplish bluish uh, it's mixed and then I put the flower you see over here those are like a baby brats and those are all pounced with the color it made beautiful designs those around the flowers and it made it gives richness to the to the flower those are roses tulips brown leaves like full color and over here it's more like faded looks a little bit it's supposed to look a little bit depth not so clear because it's on floor we're, we're zooming the picture the camera on the flower that's what it is here you see the two swans the depth of the picture far away it's the cloud darkness you see the forest and the little lake that the two swans is here with the beautiful scenery they are enjoying in the water this is one of my old paintings this is an acrylic too and then we have over here my beautiful kitty cat which has become wild cat and he's sitting in a green uh, garden you see the darker part when you do dark and smaller it's like furtherness it shows and more closer you come you make it lighter the grasses the green more green and uh, you see the cat he's enjoying the beauty in the garden so those are my paintings and uh, I hope I hope you enjoyed all the pictures that I showed you and I hope you'll try it check my other videos and if you have any comments uh, please do that I'm working in my beauty salon and in case if you need you come back in this town give me a call and send a note thank you very much I appreciate for watching